Next example, deep example, is about unborn children. So trauma of abortion or trauma of miscarriage. Often mothers do not talk about it and it becomes a family secret. Uh, abortion, miscarriage might be a heavy burden to care. And of course, it affects the whole family. A mother can feel guilty or she might feel uh, like a victim or she might afraid to lose another child and as a result she becomes controlling, obsessive for a living child. She controls his every step. She mm, does not allow him to play dangerous games and dangerous can be martial arts, soccer, baseball, swimming, hockey. So basically she does not allow him to play any sport. Uh, she controls his relationship with his friends. She controls what um, he is eating and it's over control. And of course, mother should know and should try to, you know, to watch her child to make sure that he's hanging out with the good friends, right? But when the mother went through the uh, trauma of miscarriage or abortion, she might control it's too much she might put too much no no for ice cream no for pizza no for french fries no for everything no for soda and the child is becoming like a robot because mother is controlling how he should uh, eat how he should dress with whom she he should um, be friends uh, how he should think how he should react and she does not allow him to be a child uh, once the mother accepts the fact that she lost a child and even unborn child is the part of the family, if she includes him as a member of the family, then she will be able to let go out of her control and she can replace it with love, care and support towards her child.